going on YouTube? This is your boy Real Gamer 27 and uh, first of all, I want to thank you for joining my channel. And I came across some interesting stuff that I want to bring up on y'all today. Uh, I was I wanted to bring up Resident Evil Revelations 2 that's coming to all the platforms except the Wii U and the 3DS. And uh, I was looking up looking up some numbers and I was calculating everything and I just don't understand why would Capcom would do something like this knowing that they did, you know, fairly decent on the Nintendo platform, even the Wii U, even the Wii U. I'm, I'm gonna show you what. I'm gonna show you why it did well on the Wii U, even though it doesn't look like the, like the numbers was. But you wanna look at the percentage and everything, the attach rate of of the console and all that. You're gonna you're gonna see. But first, I wanna start off with the PlayStation 3. The PlayStation 3 install base was around 76 million at that time of last year when it came when it came out. Okay. The number of units sold um, to that system was 580,000 copies of Resident Evil Revelations to that system. Okay, the attach rate to that game, 0.7%. 0.7%, y'all, not 7%. Okay, on to the next one. Let's go to the Xbox 360. 76 million install base. Okay, just like the PS3. Okay, number of units sold of that game, uh, 190,000 copies. The attach rate of that game, 0 0.25, 0 0.25, y'all hear me right, it's 0 0.25. Okay, let's skip over to the Wii U, install base around that time, 3 million. Okay, number of copies sold of that game, 90,000, okay. This is what this is what gonna uh <laughs> this is going to be a good one, okay. The attach rate of that game, three percent, three percent of the install base bought that game. Okay, let's go to the last one, the Nintendo 3DS. Um, the uh, install base, twenty nine point six million, number of units sold of that game. 790,000 the attach rate of that game 2.73 so basically so basically the Wii U had the uh, the highest attach rate of this game you got the Wii U then you got the Nintendo 3DS then you got the PlayStation 3 then last you got the Xbox 360 reason why you know that game is not coming to the Nintendo platforms I don't know maybe because third parties just can't stand Nintendo's guts it doesn't make sense if y'all do, if y'all do y'all research, do y'all homework, y'all motherfucking trolls, and stop bashing on Nintendo like you know everything, and stop, you know, listening to what other people say. If you just do your own homework, especially y'all journalists, y'all journalists, y'all just as bad, y'all just as bad as trolls. Hell, y'all the one that's, that's throwing the bait out there. Y'all feeding those trolls. You know, if y'all just, like I said, if y'all just do your homework, then a lot of this shit won't even be discussed because it just, it just doesn't make sense. On why Nintendo is getting bashed this bad by third parties and first of all like I said in my other videos you can not expect a brand new game a brand new system when the Wii U first came out to sell you know like hotcakes you know with the third party games you couldn't you can't expect that you know you can expect you know with the established install base with the 360 and the PlayStation 3 you can expect them to fit because of that massive install base that they had so I, I just I just wanted to bring that up, you know, to y'all, and I guess it's, this is all I wanted to share with you. And uh, believe me, I'm going to have some other interesting stuff to show y'all later on. Just um, just you know, stay tuned in on my channel and uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And once again, this is your boy Real Gamer 27, and have a good day.